So continuing our discussion on how to practice spirituality from the video series Spiritual Quest. So in this video, let us try to discuss that what is this power of sound of Hare Krishna Mahamantra. Sound, any sound for that matter, has a great impact on our day-to-day -day life. It is scientifically proved that out of five senses, four of the senses are in passive state when we are asleep. The sense of seeing, the sense of smelling, the sense of tasting and the sense of touch. So all these four are in passive state. But scientifically it is proved that the sense of hearing is active throughout the day. And it has a great impact that whatever we hear has a tremendous impact. And it depends what sort of impact it will be. Will it be in a good way or in an adverse way depending on what are we hearing. Now let us try to discuss that what is this power of sound in our day-to-day -day life. Now suppose a person is going for an interview and you tell him, hey look, you are looking very terrible today. And just imagine that how low his model will go down, right? And at the same time if you tell him that, hey dude, you are looking amazing, you are looking smart. His self-confidence will boost. Simple words, but so much effect, high and low. Similarly, in our life also, if someone says good about us, we feel really very good. And when someone says bad about us, we become sad and we go morose, isn't it? This is the impact of the sound of these simple words. And this impact can be terrible sometimes, which can get a person into depression, and sometimes it can be suicidal also. So if this is the impact of the sound of simple words in our day-to-day -day life, then just imagine the impact of the sound of the transcendental mantra that is the Hare Krishna Mahamantra. This Hare Krishna Mahamantra that is Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare Every word is transcendental. And the sound of this Hare Krishna Mahamantra is also transcendental. So when we chant this Hare Krishna Mahamantra, this transcendental sound vibration enters our ears, goes into the heart and cleanses the heart of the dust accumulated or the dirt accumulated from so many lifetimes. Namely, lust, anger, greed, envy, pride and illusion. So friends, logically think, if this dirt is removed from us, how light we will feel, how blissful we will feel, isn't it? And there will be no complications in life. So in this way, when a person chants the Hare Krishna Mahamantra, it becomes very easy for him to become blissful. This Hare Krishna Mahamantra meditation pushes us towards the goal of cleansing our heart and getting closer to our eternal bliss. So please do chant this Hare Krishna Mahamantra to see the power of the sound of this Hare Krishna Mahamantra. Thank you very much.